आमचे दहा आमदार जे पक्ष सोडून भाजपात गेले त्यांच्या आड याचिका आम्ही बॉम्बे उच्च न्यायालयात दाखल केली ती याचिका बॉम्बे उच्च न्यायालयात ब्रेस्तारा भार मारिली आम्ही त्या आदेशाचा खोलाईन अभ्यास केला गोळेकरांच्या प्रश्नाची जाप या आदेशात देऊ ना पण त्यांच्या मुखार आणि काय प्रश्न त्यांनी उपस्थित करून दौरल्यात त्यांची जाप कोणीतरी देऊन जाय मागीर कोणी असू येता विधानसभा सर्वोच्च न्यायालय कोण तो आमकां खबर ना गोयची मतदान टक्केवारी दिसान दिस वाढत असा ही बरी गजाल लोक पक्षाचे विश्वास दौरून मतदान करतात असे गोवा प्रदेश काँग्रेस समितीचे गिरीश सोडणकर आणि पत्रकारांकडे उलयताना सांगले ऑर्डर ऑफ दिस ऑनरेबल हायकोर्ट वी हॅव टू से दॅट दिस ऑर्डर इन्स्टेड ऑफ आन्सरिंग व्हेरियस क्वेश्चन बिफोर द पीपल ऑफ गोवा स्पेशली द वोटर्स the order raises many more questions which needs to be answered by somebody i don't know who is that somebody whether it's a parliament whether it's a supreme court or judiciary but somebody has to answer these questions especially to the voters who have full faith in the demo indian democracy and the indian constitution ani je voters asa voteran ka bhi maximum mobilize kar pa constitution the government of india everybody is encouraging them to vote to come out and vote for in a large number and good part is that the voting percentage is increasing day by day because that's the faith and the trust the voters or the citizens of india is posing in into our democratic system and into our constitution but i am a voter i am the president of a political party which has issued the b forms to various candidates now again the election commission of india continues to recognize our party and recognize me as the party president and that is how election commission of india has allowed us to contest for these elections Now, if you go by the High Court order, that our party has been merged and that has been accepted. So now there cannot be a two views. That court order says that a political party has merged, merged, and still Election Commission of India continues to recognize us, and we enjoy the full confidence of Election Commission of India. These are the two constitutional authorities. the high court is one constitutional authority whereas election commission of india is another important constitutional authority having full autonomy now with this order the basic features of the constitution comes under attack the features constitution are given am the democratic process through which the political parties put up their candidates and they go to the voters people participate they pr- promise and ultimately on the voting day people come and vote and the, the result is out and then the governments are formed so this is the generally a democratic process so the this order lays a first attack on the democratic process itself and on the constitutional norms which are conscious order high court has issued this is the order that they cannot make any attack they should safeguard the the features of the democracy or the constitution this particular order it attacks the very basic features of the democracy and that is the the democratic process the election process and that's why this this order is bad so it cannot shape the constitution it cannot shape the the democratic process it should rather strengthen it it cannot weaken the the constitution or democratic process and this will result in frustrating the voters the the general question that we were getting when we were canvassing why we should vote if we vote for one party people go to the other party so that trust is lost In the, in the democratic process, the moment the honourable High Court issues this order, so that the faith and trust of the voters is shaken completely, and that needs to be restored, and for which 
the Congress party will take a lead in this direction, as we have already uh, said earlier. We say this, this order is a license for open defection. It has opened the doors now for open defection, which is very dangerous for the future of our country, the future of the democratic process, the people who believe in the constitution and the, and the democracy. प्रायमा खातीर प्रणय शिरगावकार पणजी